Ah, yes, the sounds, the smells, the tastes, especially the tastes of Mexico becoming to Civic Center Park again this year. Colorado celebrating Cinco de Mayo, and it will be next weekend. And ahead of the festivities, and Andrea Bruella joins us to talk about it. She's the president and CEO of News Ed CDC. It's a local nonprofit that does economic development and is involved with this. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. It is such a fun event yeah. every year. <laughs> really, I do look forward to it. Yeah. Talk a little bit for people that may not be familiar about just the history of Cinco de Mayo. Um, so I'll speak on the history in Denver for, sure. for how we started it. Um, actually, Cinco de Mayo started as a street festival on Santa Fe Drive, um, really to highlight the neighborhood, the Loma Linca Park neighborhood and the Santa Fe Drive corridor, because we are an economic development organization. and. Um, it, it, it got so popular and so big and, and well attended that we moved it to the Civic Center Park in 1995. Yeah. And so now it's sort of, you know, um, <laughs> right after 420 kicks off the, the festival season. Yeah, uh -huh. and it, it is a big festival. Talk a little bit about what people can expect. We talked about the food and the music, but uh, this, this goes on for the weekend. Yeah, it's, it's both days, um, um, Saturday and Sunday, um, May 4th and 5th. And so we have lots of things planned. We have three stages um, that you know feature what you're seeing there on your screen. Uh, lots, lots of live uh, flocorico dance, um, Mexican regional mariachi, um, all the different genres of Mexican music. Um, we have a, a local uh, stage too, and that features a lot of local groups. You're seeing the Chihuahuas there. We have <laughs> we have a couple different contests. We have the Chihuahua races, and that's. A, f a crowd favorite, and that I'll happens bet it on is. <laughs> Saturday at two in the middle of the park across from the Seal Pond, and then we have um, taco eating contest uh, on Sunday at two o'clock, same area. Um, so you know, lots to f eat, lots to drink. Um, we have over you know 200 vendors, and that you know is inclusive of non-food and food vendors. Um, so yeah, it, it's it's definitely um, a, a really great cultural experience. It's definitely it's the largest cultural event in the state of Colorado. Um, so, you know, definitely bring your family, mm -hmm. um, bring your friends, um, get ready to have a good time. Uh, the event goes from 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. And, um, you know, if you're wanting to know specifically, like, who's performing on the stages, who specifically, we have all that stuff on our website at Cinco de Mayo Denver .com. All right, sounds good. Yeah. We'll put a link on our website to that. Thank you so much for yeah, coming in. Thanks and for sharing. having me. All right, have a good time next weekend.